Dear KQRS, a while back I was working for an electrician as his helper. The job was like many others. It sucked. Sure, it had some rewards. I got to see many things like how a three-way switch operates or how to hook up a fart fan in the bathroom and seeing many dumb carpenters doing their dumb carpenter stuff. One day my boss, who I will call Jeff, yelled down to me from upstairs, go into the bathroom and trip the breaker on the GFI circuit on the wall. A GFI circuit is the outlet with a little trip thing that says reset and test. It's a ground fault interrupter. Right. That's what GFI stands for. Um, oh, I is, see. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. A blow dryer or a shaver or something falls into the sink. I climbed down my ladder and went uh, into the bathroom and tripped the circuit. Sure enough, the button popped out just like it should. <laughs> uh oh, can you see this coming? <laughs> oh, no. I quickly reset the button as I'm sure this is what Jeff wanted me to do. Oh, no. <laughs> Whoops. Yep, I hit the button and then reset it. I had made an executive decision. I was an electrician. <laughs> <laughs> I felt oh, good. <laughs> no. You don't you know those feelings yeah, when you think you've done something good? And it doesn't work out. Yep. I felt good about myself. Oh. I was really learning this electricity crap. <laughs> Who needed Votech? I was learning on the job. I went back to work a few moments later. <laughs> <laughs> Where was Jeff? <laughs> this is not good. Uh. A few <laughs> A few moments later the lights in the room where I was working dimmed. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> hey, what good button for? This guy took the full blast. <laughs> oh. <laughs> A blood curdling scream followed. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> you reset the GFI, didn't you, bitch? <laughs> <laughs> There's Jeff. <laughs> Listen to this. Oh, God, I don't know if I'm going to be able to finish this letter. Okay. Uh, it's going to get rough. A blood curdling scream followed. I ran upstairs <laughs> and I found Jeff lying on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> Is he still shaking or smoking? <laughs> he was shaking as if a million volts of juice had gone through. How bad. He, he laid there for a while like he was doing the minnow out of water. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> then suddenly, with all. <laughs> What? <laughs> now picture this guy, he's flopping around on the floor. Uh -huh. He's just been socked with 8 million volts. <laughs> Suddenly, with all his remaining strength, he looked at me and said, You fat bastard! <laughs> <laughs> he mustered the strength. <laughs> oh. Oh, <Christ. laughs> you fat bastard, I thought I told you to trip the GFI. <laughs> well, as it turns out, Jeff, <laughs> <laughs> Jeff wanted me to trip the breaker on the GFI and leave it off so he could cut into the wires and make a new splice to run another outlet. Wait a minute. Something stunk. Oh, the, no. The zap of power <laughs> hit him so hard he actually filled his drawer. <laughs> <laughs> Who uh. <laughs> <laughs> needed Votech? Oh, man. <laughs> That's funny. Electric poop. <laughs> Suddenly, my boss, who I thought was so smart, seemed like an average Joe. He ended up leaving soon afterwards. He'll change his Sears tough skins. <laughs> 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 what a great letter. letter. Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> nice to have you. No. Yeah, did Michael Irvin show up? Uh, uh, after I wonder if Jeff's <laughs> listening. I wish he had been a little more thorough about what he wanted me to do. Why didn't he spell that out in the first place? What the heck does the guy <laughs> it's want? It's his me? fault. <laughs> the boss did it. Yeah. What does he want for eight bucks an hour? <laughs> <laughs> Although I will never forget the sound of Jeff's scream. Or the look on his face that day. <laughs> we, <laughs> we found out later the voltage had even melted his pliers. Oh, <laughs> my God. Well, he put them right on the wires. That's what he cut the wires with. Well, wouldn't the, wouldn't the, uh, the switch in the box uh, shut off? Too? Well, if I would, you would hope. Like that? That's probably why he's still alive. Yeah. <laughs> poor, poor, stupid Jeff. Oh! <laughs> That's Jeff's fault. Yeah. That's what he gets. 
it's funny how sometimes life sneaks up on you and bites you right in the ass, or in this case, makes you poop yourself. Yeah. So let this be a lesson to all of you electrician wannabes out there. Keep your uglies bugged at all times for danger, because you never know when it might strike. Happy zapping warmly, Mr. Electricity. Yeah. Wow. Joe? Yes. This is one of the funniest letters I've ever heard. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Oh, my God. So you didn't last as an electrician very long, did you? Um, no, you know, he didn't want to pay me a lot, either. <laughs> I wonder why. Yeah. He didn't want you around. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, you know, he would, he would do things like that, too. He'd, he'd zap me, and he would think it was so funny, but when you zapped Jeff, it wasn't... He so didn't think it was so cool. Is it? Jeff okay? Did he ever recover? Uh, well, actually, Jeff has passed on. Oh, oh. my God. Oh, no. Within days of this Happy happening? ending to the story. Eh? But it, wa it wasn't because of any zapping or anything like that. From you? No, I didn't have anything to do with this. Joe, great, great letter. Thank oh. you, sir. Okay, you are welcome. <laughs> <laughs> but he should have asked him what life-threatening job he has yeah. now. I guess Jeff yeah. is listening Jeff up there in the big dead. Oh. power, or what do you call it, the... Uh, the substation in the sky. <laughs> yeah. Exactly Thanks. what you're thinking of. We'll be back in 60 seconds. Glass Service Company brings you more listener mail right after this. KQ92. Stop.